The trout, the trout, the trout in the towers, the wolves of the fish, and they all ran away. The trout, he fucked all the hours. The great Jamie Lannister, Kingslayer, Oath Breaker, brought to his knees by the men of the North. And set free by the women. You'd think he'd done it himself the way he tells it. Old Forrester's sword won't clean itself, you know. Make sure it's spotless this time. Old Forrester won't be happy with blood and brains all... Now that is a proper sword. I'll have one like it myself someday. You? You'll never have a sword like that. I say that as a friend. Oh, don't be an arse, Bowen. <laughs> Apologies, your lordship. I had Andy, you know. <laughs> Andy what? Capturing him. He was nowhere near the Kingslayer at the Whispering Wood. He was so drunk, he barely made it out of his tent. So what really happened? Someone caught him, I suppose. That skinny man here, and they'll say it was them. You captured the Kingslayer. Aye. Well, I don't have to do it. Aye. And round his ankle as ten others took him down. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? I brought him to his knees. Lord Forrester. Not before he dragged you halfway across the battlefield on your face. You're questioning <laughs> Norrin's honor. I'm questioning Norrin's story. Which grows more far-fetched every time he tells it. Get your liege lord some wine. Go on. It's your job. Right, thanks. You're welcome. Thank you, Garrett. I'll do it. Norrin's family has faithfully served House Forrester for centuries. His honor is beyond reproach, and House Tully is forever in his debt. They've never seen a field plowed so well as the day the Kingslayer dragged poor Norrin across the battlefield. <laughs> Fetch your cup. Tonight we celebrate. <laughs> to Rob Stark, the King in the North! The, the King, King in the North! North! Tomorrow, we march on Casterly Rock, and House Forrester has been given the greatest honor to lead the Young Wolf's army and ride as the vanguard! The gods have favored us. Onward to Casterly Rock! Aye! Aye! To the Lannisters! Aye! Iron from ice! Aye! Got it. Yes, my lord? I need you to keep an eye out for Roderick. As his father, I could not be more proud of the man he's become. On a night like this, Men find false courage at the bottom of their cups. I'd rather he were here. Yes, my lord. There's also the question of what's to be done with you. It's been on my mind for a while now. With me, my lord? You've served House Forrester well for several years now, but I can't expect you to squire forever. How shall I reward your loyalty? What can I offer you? To bring honor to House Forrester, my lord. You have more honor than those who were born to it. There were those who had their doubts when your uncle put forth your name as my squire. But you've erased those doubts entirely. It would be an honor to see you riding by Roderick's side in the vanguard tomorrow. Not as a squire, but as the equal of any man who serves House Forrester. It's well deserved, Garrett. Thank you, my lord. I promise. I won't let you down. That I don't doubt. But for now, keep this between us. We're celebrating tonight. I wouldn't want the other squires to feel discouraged. Yes, my lord. Now go, and find Roderick if you can. I will, my lord. Thank you. Bloody hell. Empty. Squire! Fetch us more wine! Can you give me a hand? Come on. Can I get up to you? Yeah, no problem. 
I have been a squire longer than you. So? I outrank you. You should help me. Fetch more wine, scrub my armor, clean my boots. Just my luck to end up with Norin while you serve the Lord. Let him fetch his own wine for once. You'd better watch your tongue, Bowen. It could be much worse. What the fuck do you know about it? Nothing is worse than Norin. See, that's why you're lucky. Low expectations. If I'd grown up covered in pig shit, shovel and slop, well, maybe I'd think saddling his horse was the greatest honor in the Seven Kingdoms. I suppose this beats pig farming. Who doesn't love bacon? Ah, pig farmers. <laughs> All I'm saying is, at this rate we'll never be more than this, which is nothing. The lowest of the law. For all I know, we could be squires for life. All in wine around a fucking wedding. Give it time. You'll get there. No easy for you to say. Maybe if my uncle were castling at House Forester, I'd feel different. Who my uncle is has nothing to do with it. How much further? That's right over there. Take your time. You lot have drunk your share. Good thing Lord Walders. In a generous mood. Fucking phrase. Nice night for a wedding. Not often he finds a willing husband for one of his daughters. Don't expect me to carry it for you, Sir Garrett. What's wrong? What's gotten into you? You're acting rather odd. Nothing. I'm fine. I'm so glad to hear it. I'll take the fucking flagon already. What's wrong with him? Something the matter? Owen, we have to go. You go if you're in such a rush. But what about? What the hell was that about? Slow down, would you? What's the rush? They've got weapons. Who brings fucking weapons to a wedding? We need to find Roderick. He's out there by himself. Keep moving, my lord. That never make it. They'll hunt us down like dogs. Well, the phrase says time's over. Guard this with your life. Return it high in wrath where it belongs. This. <clears throat> Be damned if I let it fall into the hearts of those traitors. What the say you have to go. Your... I will do as you command, my lord. You have served me well. I know I can count on you. Tell your uncle. <laughs> Tell him. The North Grove must never be lost. Tell no one but him. Do you understand? You must swear. Tell only your uncle, Duncan. I swear that I will, my lord. Hey, it's those foresters! Now go. Oh, your honor, you must do this for your house! Go! Kill those uh. fucking foresters! <laughs> With love!
Rod. Fresh. That's father's car. Lord Bolton better give us fucking titles for this. Winter may be common, but at least still have his bacon. <laughs> Move along, boy. There's nothing for you here. Father, I said move on. I recognize you. You're a forester squire. Former Stark bannermen have no claim on land anymore. Or haven't you heard? The Starks are dead. Where'd you get that sword? Not a chance that sword is his. Must have stolen it. Out here by himself? Probably a deserter. None of your fucking business. We're gonna feed you to the fucking pigs. That sword's too big for you, boy. You can barely pick it up. Get off my land! This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new Warden of the North. I reckon he'd like a proper lordly sword like that. No. I'll have that sword, boy. Fuck you. Finish this fucking pig farmer. Pathetic. You really are a pig farmer. for this. That much I promise. <laughs> Father? <laughs> Garrett! You survived! <laughs> your, your sister! <laughs> she hid. I tried to stop them.
I'll kill the man who did this. <laughs>